well this is fun and familiar and scary and different all at the same time. Gosh it's weird talking into a camera, I was not doing it for so long. Hello humans! Hasn't it been a while? Yes, I'm still alive, I'm still using the internet, I have not gone and fallen into this hole of a place of nowhere to return. That did not make grammatical sense, but oh well, here we are. Some of you might be angry that I haven't been posting, and if you're angry, then I'm sorry that you uh, find my content so wonderful. That was really arrogant. I'm not Kanye, I promise. You guys may or may not know, but Bella and Book's YouTube channel is not uh, the only internet place that I inhabit. I also have a blog, um, bellarmbooks.wordpress.com, which is soon to become just bellarmbooks.com. My dad bought me the domain name for Christmas because, you know, what do teenage girls ask for Christmas other than domain names? I love it, by the way. I think it's the best thing ever. I also tweet and I also Facebook and I'm considering Instagramming. I'm not sure yet because I'm kind of like, you're all in my private life. And then that's my private life. And I'm like, well, some of my private life can be a personal life. Personal and private are the same thing. I don't know. All up in the air. But basically, if you haven't heard on all my social media channels, I haven't been uploading because for a while I didn't have access to an editing suite. The laptop that I've been using to edit since I began YouTube last year in March, I think it was, um, did not like editing software anymore. If browsing the internet is kind of just a walk and then trying to watch YouTube videos kind of a jog, then rendering a video is like a sprint. And obviously you don't sprint like this, but you know, I don't know how to run because I'm not an athlete and I'm totally okay with that. The point is, my laptop couldn't handle it and I had to stop editing lest I basically break the laptop. At this point in time, it's currently still not working, but that is okay because we have something better. We have something even greater. We have the beautiful daughter of mine that is Sylvie the MacBook Pro. She's just my best friend and she's lovely and she is going to help us achieve YouTube greatness, guys. She's going to get us here. Her and late night editing. Basically, I bought Sylvie because I needed a device on which I could edit and I could edit well. Sylvie has a 2.5 GHz processor, she has retina display, she's a 15 inch, she's basically an editing beast. She's the most beautiful thing I've ever seen in my entire life. But now that I've come back to YouTube, there are fun things that are going to be happening. As you will have seen from the new channel art and a new but still lovely profile picture and the new blog theme over at bellownbooks.wordpress.com, Hint, hint, go check it out, you would know that things have changed. So with all these beautiful new aesthetic changes, there are also going to be some new, just general changes. As this is Bella and Books, I want it to be about Bella and Books, which sounds stupid and you might not be getting what I'm saying, but that's what I'll explain. For a long time after I started this YouTube channel, I felt like I could only talk about books, and that really hurt me because I was like, all I love is books. March 2014, Bella. September 2014, I want to talk about feminism. So I kind of found myself in this unhappy place of um, I can't talk about what I want to talk about because what I want to talk about is more than just books now. What's going to be happening is on Wednesdays, which have been the usual upload days, there will be a Bella video. A Bella video could range from anything from a feminism rant to a room tour to a vlog to a comedy sketch just to a sit down and chat video because it's really just going to be a way for me to express myself and however the heck I'm feeling in that point of time. And then the books video will probably just be Fangirl Friday, let's be honest. Bella's creative energies are being zapped by high school. Grade 11, get off my back. Go away. I do not want to write a 1,000 word draft to on Tuesday. But also with these videos that are going to be coming out, there is going to be exclusive content over on my website. Look at me linking in all the social internetness. This is what professionals do. Holla at Bella trying to become professional so she can earn money from YouTube and just stay at home all day. Ultimate goal. Put it out there, ultimate goal. So this exclusive content is going to be coming out the day after a video is released. So if a video is published on Wednesday, the exclusive content will be coming out on Thursday. If a video comes out on Friday, the exclusive content will be coming out on a Saturday. It's basically just a way to integrate all the things, all the places, all the internet sites into the one Bella and Books. Now this exclusive content is just going to be bloopers from these videos. And that's all I really have to say. I think I've just babbled so I might reshoot this because I don't know how much of it actually made sense. Thank you guys so much for just putting up with this hiatus. As always, all my social media is below. My Facebook, my Twitter, my website, my Society6. Is that even still a thing? Do I even still own that website? I tried to sell prints once. That went really well. Here's a video. Thank you all so much. I love you all and goodbye. 
Do I film a Fangirl Friday? Do I film a Fangirl Friday? <gasps> I can talk about Benedict Cumberbatch. To change my shirt. That's how you convince people that you haven't shot all your videos in one day. You change your shirt. Probably a hairstyle as well. Um, 